Hello everybody, welcome back to Smoke Dragon Crest 11, and we are here in Galopolis. We dealt with the Urgera Star, I guess, sort of. We had the weird Toko, I think that's what you call them. A lot of weird stuff. This is basically a side quest, which I still, I... Yeah, so let's go and talk to the Sultan. Or the forest, to be more specific. Let's see what happens now. I mean... The problem with the Urgera Star is dealt with. But now let's find out more about uh, the thing that Rab has found out about. I forgot, I really forgot the word, the name that Rab found that was engraved in the star. Let's see if we can get more information from this now. That'd be cool. Hello, my dear friend. I was just telling my father of all that came to pass out there upon the sands. You should tell him what you saw too. He will be eager to hear your version of events, I am sure. It is a relief to see you safe, my friends. When the star shattered, I could not help but fear the worst. Faris has explained all that came to pass out upon the sands. It seems a savior appeared and destroyed the lantern before it could lay waste to my kingdom. Aye. Though, I wouldn't go calling him your savior just yet. Anyway, never mind that now. There's something I want to ask you, Your Majesty. The runes on the barrier around the star, they spelled out a word, Kalasmus. Does that mean anything to you? Kalasmus? Hmm. Sadly, it does not. Well, if it was written on the side of a star, you can bet it means something. Something important. Hmm. Yeah, but we can't go letting it distract us too much. Mordigan's not going to defeat himself. We've work to be getting on with. Lord Robert, your quest to defeat the Lord of Shadows is a noble one. The people of Galopolis will be praying for your success. Yes. And if there is ever anything you require, you need only ask. After all, I still owe you a favor. Oh, I clean forgot. We need to ask the Sultan about that hammer that used to belong to Erdwin. Oh, oh that's funny. You actually led into that. Huh. Let's talk about it. Is there something I can help you with, Lord Robert? As a matter of fact, there is. I need to pick your brains about a giant hammer that's supposed to be kept here in Galopolis. We're going to need it to defeat Mordigan, and apparently, you lot have had it since the Age of Heroes. Hmm. A giant hammer, you say? Ah, oh, yes! You mean the forging hammer? It has been in the royal family for generations. Ferris, fetch the forging hammer from the treasure room. Hmm. <laughs> Aye, this is it. This is Erdwin's hammer, the one we saw in the vision. Father, do you truly intend to give the hammer away? We had intended to sell it in order to fund this year's San Nation. <gasps> Silence! Insolent boy! <clears throat> the forging hammer is one of Galopolis's greatest treasures. It has been handed down through the generations since time immemorial. But if we must relinquish it, then so be it. You are the only ones who can defeat the Lord of Shadows. If you need it, it is yours. My nurse once told me that the power of the spirit of the land resides within the forging hammer. It is said that it can beat even the hardest of metals into shape. At least, I think that is how the story goes. 
Well, I hope it helps you on your quest. Best of luck, dear friends. I shall be expecting good news. You know, at least they're still plucky, I guess. Well, we got one. Uh, it, it took a video, but we finally got the foraging hammer. Huh. <laughs> oh, next stop, Hoto. Uh, I'm assuming something's happening in Hoto as well. So, let's make way. Um, let's see. I don't think there should be anything else happening over here. Nope. At least, you know, it's not dark and dreary and all that anymore, right? That, it was pretty bad. It was kind of bad. Okay, zoom. Hoto. Let's go. Let's see what troubles are over there and let's see if we can fix it. It is a small place. I mean, Servando was here. I wonder if Servando was at Galapagos. I think he passed by, right? Uh, he was here. Alright, here we are, Hoto. Hmm, let's check. I'm, I'm kind of happy we're here. Your words perplex me. A forge within the mountain. Now is not the time. A beast is abroad. Seek Miko in the temple. Learn there of our plight. I was wondering if he was ever going to see this person. I don't think I've seen them yet. I don't remember. I might have. If we were allowed, anyways. But we shall help. Maybe we actually get to fight a boss this time. We're probably going to destroy them because I think we're way over level for this. For this. Because I think. No, no, no. I think we have to have gone here afterwards, right? We'll see based on the cutscene. tidings. The one assailed by the fiend. Sleeps still like the bear. Fair Mistress Miko, the rite cannot be performed with the beast abroad. <sighs> Silence, whining cur! A monk spirit is equal to any monster! <sighs> This accursed wound. Till it heals, I am helpless. The right left undone. Well, I sure wouldn't want to get on the wrong side of her. Oh, but we have guests. Forgive the storm of my rage. My shame knows no bounds. The wind blew you here. Surely it was not by chance. Will you hear my tale? The Angry Mountain. A rite must be performed there, lest fire consume us. But disaster looms. A monk was sent to pray, yet a beast blocked his path. The fiend loomed, monstrous. Fierce of fang and sharp of claw. He ran for his life. I longed to hunt it. But I faced another foe and suffered this wound. A great fire dragon. Tatsunaga the Terror. Now he is no more. Forgive my boldness, but the beast blocks our lifeline. Slay it in my stead. I greet your kind words, as the step in high summer greets the falling rain. Head first to the west. You will find a mountain path. There the monster waits. Oh, guiding spirit. Guardian of rock and flame. Protect these brave souls. I can't tell if we could have been here earlier. I still don't know. I assume yes. Our brave defender, as you face the savage beast, our hopes go with you. Take the rusted path, the beast haunts the mountain slopes, terror without end. Okay, I gotta go rest. Actually, I want to think I want to check. I want to check the shop here. Um, actually, no. Because I could have I could have come here earlier. So the shop probably isn't that impressive, I'll be honest. I'm just gonna leave. Okay, let's deal with this.
Let's see, uh, West, that is where we... have been there before. Horse Hailer, let's use this. Okay, West, Mount Fuji, right? Wait, the Cryptic Crypt. That's where we've been before. Wait, there's a red door over there, hold on. If I don't open that red door now, I'm never opening it. So give me one sec. Have I been to Mount Fuji? Apparently not. You know what? Yeah, I was about to say, like, you know, I don't think I'm gonna do that. But if I don't do this now, I am never doing this, so. Oh, are these the same enemies? No, they probably have red eyes, right? Turn around. Yeah, they got red eyes. Oh, wow, well, only 20? Oh, that, it, I don't do that very often. It doesn't do anything. I'm also gonna rest because. I want to be able to um, zoom here. Okay, cool. Let us keep on moving. The red door. Oh, got more of these. It's kind of useless as iron ore and all that, but it's fine. Oh, it's... Well, it's unlocked now. It's fine. Open. Vanishing Blade. Hmm. Vanishing Blade. Let's check it out. 91 damage. Compared to what I currently have with, like, uh, Silvando. No. No. With, um... Uh, who has a good... Sim a weapon of similar damage? Like... Okay. I don't have anything of similar damage. I don't use one-handed swords. I mean Eric, but I'm assuming those are naturally weaker anyway, so... I don't really have anything to compare it to, actually, now. Like axes? I'm assuming axes are naturally stronger, so... Alright. Regardless, I don't really use swords on any of my characters, except for maybe Silvando. Alright, Mount Huji, here we come. Gotta go up this path. I guess I've never been here before, huh? Here here stands Mount Huji. Those who seek entry should go and visit Hoto. We have. Oh, maybe it was blocked off before, right? That could have been it. Golden Reigns. It's the Race Dragon Globulus. Oh. of here! Go on! Go away! <sighs> go away! Or I will eat you! The beast is upon us! Stand fast! I... I am the spirit of the mountain! And I have very, very sharp claws! If you do not want to be torn to pieces, you had better get out of here! We're going nowhere. Not until you promise to stop bullying innocent monks and let the villagers climb the mountain. Huh? Um, was it something I said? Sh shouldn't they be running away? Well, what are we going to do? Shut up, idiot! They will hear us! How are we going to scare them away if you keep jabbering? This is all your fault, Aptico! Now we are in trouble! Shut up, Atto! If you had not fallen over, we would never have ended up in this mess! Uh, 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 
so much for our big scary monster. It's just a couple of little ones. You surprised us, darlings. Foolish children. What possessed you to risk your lives with such recklessness? <sighs> no, we never meant to. <clears throat> we have done no wrong. Miko's right has to be stopped. A tragedy looms. Yes, yes! You have to listen to my brother. Miko wants to do a horrible thing and we have to stop her. Seems these bairns have got a bee in their bonnet about something. We'd better get to the bottom of this. You will hear us out. Other grown-ups ignore us, as mountains do rain. Do you really think they will? Is someone finally going to listen to us? I think so. And they seem very strong. With them on our side, people are sure to listen. Hmm. <laughs> We have a hideout, a den, like a fox's home. We will meet you there. Hurry, hurry! <laughs> <laughs> huh, every time I feel like... Um, every time I feel like we're about to fight a boss, it ends up not being a boss at all. Um, okay. Oh, it's very cool looking too. Entry. Hooray! You are. <clears throat> Thank you for coming. We have been awaiting you. As seeds await spring. These people, my son, the travelers you spoke of? Light in the darkness? Yes, mother, they came. The ones who did not treat us, as horses treat flies. You said you were trying to stop the right. Why would you wish to do so? The right is sacred. Or so we have long been taught. But this is just wrong. To appease the gods, a sacrifice will be made. Our own dear mother. <sighs> Human sacrifice? Oh my! This right is just not right! Miko gathered us. She made a grave pronouncement. A great shadow fell. In happier times, we offered up fruit, silk, corn. But those days are gone. Without sacrifice, living flame will consume us. The volcanoes rage. <sighs> The Lord of Shadows has got a lot to answer for. I was selected. A gift for the volcano. A live offering. But why me? Why now? It was the mountain that chose. Or so Miko said. Mother gave us life. So we had to fight for hers. It is our duty. A noble cause indeed. I see now why you did what you did. For the whole tree's sake, one leaf falls into the flames. Perhaps I should go. No! Do not say that! You know your sacrifice is just an excuse! A few short days passed. Our mother saw Miko go, where she should not be. Miko learned of this, she now wants the truth buried. A mother also. She hides a secret. Up there on the mountainside. Why else would she go? It certainly sounds like something fishes afoot. Maybe the lad is right. It can't hurt to take a look, at least. <gasps> you will take us there. This is music to our ears. As sweet as birdsong. Beyond this ladder, a path leads into darkness, the volcano's heart. Hmm. So I guess when it comes to the story, 
we got Jade now, but I guess we still don't have Eric or Serena, I guess. Oh, take a talk, Master Luminary. You never believe the hijinks involved in getting my mitts on this password. Allow me to regale you with the, uh, another time you say it. Yes, but of course, the password is. Thank you. How can you take, you can you, is something wrong, Jade? <laughs> you can use the password to, you have, you gave, I gave you to visit another world. <laughs> I can't. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, calm down. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, she was having a she was having a meltdown over there. Jeez. Okay, let's see where this is. I mean, Hoto was a place we barely had a lot of interactions with the entire place, but especially with like the leadership, because we usually do interact with leadership in all the places we go to. With the exception of this one place. Oh. Secret entrance. A lot of places. Okay. I mean, it's just gonna be a lot of running, right? Oh, it's an enemy. Oh my gosh. Let's go! Um, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, I just slick slime. I was like, there's no way that's, um... I was like, there's no way that's a metal slime, right? Like, that's very weird chances of that happening. Okay. We win again. Hey, Silvando level ups. What are you guys leveling up for? It, you know, it's a lot of experience to level up, you know. Okay. As soon as I saw a slime, I was like, ooh, that's exciting. A lot of experience is like, oh, no, it's not metal slime. Oh. That's a shame. It's not exactly what I thought it was. Definitely was not. Okay. Let's go over here. Where does this lead? Something must happen here, right? A dead end, it seems. All twists and turns exhausted. The path leads nowhere. Oof. Well, it's a shame and all, but how about we get out of here? I don't know about you, but I'm sweating like a... <gasps> what in the world was that? It didn't sound good, whatever it was. Down there! Look! Tatsunaga, the beast Miko spoke of. But did she not claim to have slain it? This is her secret. She did not beat the dragon. She left it to live. That liar, that cheat. Mother will not die for this. Miko must be stopped. Let us hurry back. The people deserve to know. The truth must be told. Uh, okay, we turn to Miko Shrine Hoto and tell everyone about Katsunaga. I can zoom there at least. Hoto. That's very easy. So apparently we are meant to be here after everything's said and done. Okay, cool. Oh, that means this is actually the farthest we've got to in the story? Right? Hold on, actually, I, I, now I really want to go to the stores. Since this is the farthest we've got to, because we have Eric and Serena here. Um, they must have the best equipment in the game now, right? Alright, quick stop. Oh, actually, oh, the, the equipment must be really good, huh? Because I can't actually even access them yet. Ooh, interesting. It better be some really good equipment if I don't even have access to them right now. I always find it strange this is one of the places in the game that has two 
the item shops. It's so bizarre. Like, why is there two? All right, Miko. Let's talk to them. Everybody! Everybody! Be still, Axuo. You must be like a spring breeze, not a howling gale. I will not be still. I will howl it to heaven. Tatsunaga lives! What nonsense he speaks. Tatsunaga is no more. Miko told us so. No, the creature lives. It roars and howls in its lair, loud as the mountain. <sighs> you lie, wretched child. A beast blocks the way upward you could not have passed. Ha! I am the beast. The unholy fiend you feared? Me and my sister. What? We took our mother and sought to keep you from her with a bold disguise. Idiot children. Your games will see us all killed by the mountain's rage. Ha! Why believe you? You whose tales of bold conquest were naught but hot air. The beast was not slain. You gave away our futures to save your own skin. Snake, devil, spider. You seek not sacrifices. You seek dragon food. Your scheme lies exposed. Your bargain with the dragon will not save you now. And what of you? Hmm? The son who fought beside you. Was his soul sold too? Enough! <gasps> Hush, mewling kitten. What do you know of the truth? Of sacrifices? <laughs> Can it truly be? The dragon's death a facade? Dislodged by the breeze? If so, why all this? Why sate the mountain's anger? We die anyway. Silence! The dragon is gone. My beloved son slew him and paid with his life. Now, meddling brat, test the mountain's wrath no more. You risk all our lives. Bring forth your mother. The flames burn ever stronger while our time grows short. You shall not have her! I see through your web of lies. Accursed spider! <sighs> No. That's raw. Come quickly. That's an aga. Dragon, it is but a boy! <gasps> Mistress Miko. To sate your hunger, I give up my mortal form. The fox feeds her cub. No! Mistress Miko! Quickly! 
fire! He will kill us all! Fate hangs by a thread. We must fight fire with cold steel. You must face the beast. <clears throat> That is so confusing. I don't. I did I miss something? What the heck is going on? <laughs> Why did she sacrifice herself? It's not something is wrong, right? Am I? Is is it just me, or is something like really off right now? Like we're right here, you know. Hold on, give me a sec. I really need to confirm this. Huh, so this is an actual fight? It's... Okay, you know, we're gonna fight. Okay. Apparently it's the worst one from the 10 seconds I spent searching this up. You saw it swallow the priestess. Be on your guard. I'm so confused on that still. Like, why? Why was that a thing? Why was that necessary? Like, at all? Alright. Alright, let's go. Ooh, Jade, perfect. Okay, we vamp. Apparently, I guess he does a lot of dot damage, I think. Uh, we're gonna use uh, Rider's Rain. We have not done yet! Give him a little bit of healing over time. Alright, hero. Uh, why can't I use this? Okay, I have to use a sword. Uh, at some point in time, I will have one. Uh, pet powers. What pet powers do you got right now? Okay. Before I'm buffed, I'll use these little enemies. Ooh, oh, okay. That hits kind of hard. Okay. Magic, right? Um, magic barrier. Boom. Okay, now this is going to start doing tons of damage. Let's do this. Alright, Rab. Let's give you, give the enemy a sap. Okay, and now we're good to go. Quadra slash time. Hmm. Let's see, magic bearer. Multi feet. Run for you too. Look how much damage that is. It's so much. Alright, Rab, you gotta heal a hero. He's he's a little he's not looking too great. Let's get you patched up. Okay, um let's see, Mesh Barrows 2. Uh buff everyone's defense. Uh, buff. Keep spamming that multi feed. What? Multi feed hits ours. like a truck. Oh my cheese. I mean, I'm also over leveled, but at the same time, that was multi feed doing just insane amounts of work. That the damage difference is not that much higher. It isn't. I don't think so. The beast flees! Chastened! Dust settles! Sunlight returns! The village is saved! <sighs> the bitter truth dawns. Day breaks. Its light hush, cruel. Miko is no more. First Ryu? Now, Miko, the lion's taken from us. Only sheep remain. Did you see her trying to protect that thing before it ate her? What was that about, huh? Who can know her mind? The sun of her heart eclipsed. Treachery blinds her. But one thing is clear. Until its flame is smothered, 
The beast is a threat. Tatsunaga's lair, at the heart of the mountain, reached by the great gate. It must be unlocked. Miko's maid, she has the key. Come now, to the shrine. I do hope we get some information on this. Oh, and also it was because the reason why it was so easy was because this wasn't the this wasn't the big fight. This was the this was the preliminaries. It was the prelim it was the first fight, not the second one, I guess. This wasn't the big fight. Okay. The maid should be somewhere in here. The gods so cruel to pile like rocks upon her, burden on burden. We came for the key, the one for the mountain gate. There, the dragon waits. With Miko's light gone, yours is the only glimmer. Take it, it is yours. We have the key. Clouds part. The way ahead clears. The end is at hand. Hmm. Wait. Hmm? You must know the truth. It sleeps between these pages. Wake it. Make it yours. Looks like a diary of some kind. Must be Miko's. My sins rend my heart. I must confess them or scream. Thus I record them. The battle was fierce. At last the dragon lay prone. My son drew his sword. But then, like a fog, blackness rose from the dragon. Poor Yu was smothered. I carried him home. He tried to fight the darkness, but the night prevailed. The beast had cursed him. Pain racked my poor boy's body. I watched his form change. He was a dragon. I had to hide him away, pretend he was dead. <gasps> Can her words be true? Not Tatsunaga, but Ryu. This is who we fought? Hey, don't interrupt, honey. I want to hear how it ends. Could he be restored? A storm of doubts assailed me. But then the skies cleared. The magic mirror in which true forms are revealed. This might save my son. Alas, the mirror neither revealed nor restored. Though I tried and tried, my son's hunger grew. The hunger of the dragon for the flesh of men. It burns like hot sun. The agony of knowing. The choice that I make. But my son must live. Till I master the mirror I wear by my heart. Thus have I chosen. Though others' lives are squandered, my boys must be saved. Ugh, it's a tragic tale. The poor woman, torn between her child and her people, is a choice you wouldn't wish on anybody. Maybe if we could get our hands on that mirror she mentioned, we might have more luck with it than she did. But Miko is gone. The magic mirror with her. The light of hope fades. You cannot be saved. Only the creature remains. You must forget him. Mother devourer. Peril. Foul scourge. Murderer. 
The beast must be slain. Yes, the time has come. Meet me on the western path, before the great gate. Okay, the great gate. Um, I think it's faster if I just get there from here. Um, does that mean the shop is open? I know it's a weird thing for me to ask. But is the shop open now? Uh, that would be nice. Uh, let's check. At least it all makes sense now. Uh, it doesn't make any- Oh, it's you two. So, you're planning on going after that dragon on its own tarf, eh? Well, at long last, as long as you've got the key to the gate, you should be sorted. The thing's ruined it, so this is your chance to finish it off. Just go in there, bish bash bosh, job done. Without the high priestess to give them orders, the people here don't have the first clue what to do. I learned to look after myself after my mummy left. Compared to everyone here, I'm a grown-up. I mean, you two look a lot better. Why is there one of them just hanging out over there? They really are just hanging out, huh? Now, can I purchase stuff though? That'd be great. Let's go inside and check. Oh, you guys still aren't selling anything? Oh, jeez. I know you said your reasonings, but still. You guys aren't selling anything? <laughs> Alright then. That means we gotta... Here with the dragon, we gotta rest. I don't know um, if there's a rest stop in between. I know there's a campfire outside, but like... That's, uh, kinda, that's actually out of the way. Right? I'm gonna beat up this dragon, and then that'll be it. Hope it's as easy as the first one. I was, I was really confused. I was like, man, it was really that easy, huh? The dragon slayer lies somewhere within the mountain, source of all evil. Muster your courage, head rest on the mountain path. Destiny awaits. Will do. Mm, let's see. Come with the hour, come with the monster. Oh, tweaking time. Oh, okay, that's... Um, let's see, items. Oops, almost used the wrong item. Has this always been here? What is this? It's just a shading. It looks so strange, huh? Okay. Um, let us go back to Mount Fuji. Now we can, we can take the actual path. It's so... Man, it sucks. I'm, also, I'm really excited for the next Dragon Quest game. Because, for one, this game is great. I'm having a great time, overall. And... 12 is supposed to be... I mean, if it's... I don't know. I, 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 have, I have expectations now. A warm welcome face. Like the spring after winter. Throw open the gate. I must see the end of the dragon and his tail. I must come with you. All right, Caldera upper area or entry forbidden. I mean, I'm assuming it's this area. I mean, that place actually looks blocked off. It's also called Entry Forbidden. Bizarre. Okay, now let's see, where is it? It's probably just... There is... I wonder if to get over there. Wait a minute. Uh, enough horns are strong enough punch, might be able to smash through this. Weird. Okay. Let's go this way. It's really hard to tell where I'm, where I should be going. Hey, there's the thing with strong horns. Oh, I ran into that. Okay, we're gonna show no mercy. It's fine. I 
thing makes a lot of noise now, doesn't it? I have a lot of Sages Elixirs, so I don't have a problem when it comes to MP anymore, which is good. So the monster should be this way. Ouch. Did you get burned by that? What the? Oh, it's those hands. Nice. Okay, there is the thing. There's a chest right in front, though. Oh, oh wow, it just gives you four files of Sages Elixir, too. Everyone's almost at full health already. Okay, um... Ooh, no save point or anything, huh? Let's get to it. Is this really him? The man who once fought for good? Reborn as a beast? Once kind as the sun? Once gentle as the spring breeze? Now he burns, rages. For our dear home's sake, I would gladly give my life. He said this to me. He must be released. For Hotto's sake, and for his. Please, end this sadness. Okay. Stay focused. Now the real fight begins. Alright, start off. Revamp. Um, let's see. Should I just spam Quadra Slash? I shouldn't, right? I should wait like a turn. Whales. Ooh. Oh, you actually do a hefty amount of damage, don't you? That was a lot of damage. Using right is rain. 22 isn't much, but it helps. Okay. Magic Bearer. Um, should I use multi feet? I feel like Miracle Moon's probably better, right? Yeah. Um, let's see. We are gonna use. Let's insulate. Let's see, blunt. Uh, we, we're gonna reduce your defense. We need to get rid of you ASAP. Quadra Slash. Okay. You don't have anything that, like, just. No, magic bearer, everybody. Boom, there we go. And we're just gonna use multi feet from this point on. 888 damage, nice. Okay. I mean, Blunt seems to be doing a, does a good job too, I think. There we go. Yeah, Quadra Slash. Let's keep spamming this. Okay, we're doing fine. Uh, let's see, anything that's really important right now. Is the number of blows blocked the user's shield. That can deflect enemies' desperate attacks. It's only on himself though, sadly. Use the user. Double up. No. Okay, nothing in there I think is really necessary. Uh, we gotta buff everyone's defense though. All right, you though. You are getting multi heal. Here you go, buddy. All right. Oh, Hendrick again. Oh, perfect. Buff your defense again. All right. Multi feet. That hits hard. Hits real hard. That's okay. Um, buff everyone's defense again. Do not give in. Multi feet. Alright. Uh, let's see. 
more heal on Hero. Go, he doesn't have that much strength at this point. Okay, okay. I think we're good. We're doing real good. Should I revamp again? What's your health? Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on. We're revamping one more time. I was like, oh no, this looks bad. Okay, there we go. Let's see, Hendrick, what can you do? Raise everyone's defense again? No, I don't think that's really necessary. Magic barrier? One yes, magic barrier. Alright, more heal. Here you go, laddie! Okay, oh, let's see. Scrap metal. Scrap metal! Oh, nice. Good job, Hendrick. Well, that was easy. That fight looked really tough if I wasn't really high level. I don't like the look of this. Mirror now mastered. The season of the beast ends. That of peace begins. At last, I shed my shell of torment and walk in the sun. The mirror's power, though great, could not show the truth. That truth lay within, with it inside me. At last, the miasma cleared. The curse was broken. One question remains. How did the mirror get there? What brought the out in? Um. Alas, time grows short. My spirit ebbs like the tide. I drift from life's shore. Only this. Tell my mother I love her. I await her there. When first we came here, rage burned in me at Miko, at her treachery. But though she did wrong, she did it with good reason, or so she believed. She loved her son Ryu, just as we love our mother, as the fox its cubs. <sighs> now to the village. Sun shines on Hotto once more. We must share the news. Um, at least... So they did defeat the first dragon, right? At least that's what I assumed was the case. At last we are saved. Your courage is as boundless as the starry skies. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Can you forgive us? To condone your sacrifice brought eternal shame. The past is buried. A new season greets us all. A season of sun. How can the sun shine on a village whose people drift now, rudderless? We believed in lies, trusted one who betrayed us. Who now will guide us? Grown-ups not supposed to be able to think for themselves? The dragon is gone. For this, we thank our friends here, but Miko the most. Though she betrayed us, we only live thanks to her. Our breath is her gift. To sacrifice us must have burned hotter than fire. We must forgive her. A new dawn awaits. We must make our own future. She died that we might. <laughs> they do not need to know the whole truth. They have seen tragedy enough. The people of Hotto must rely on themselves now. And Atsuko and I will make sure they do. <laughs> hmm. That's a Naga Terminator. Yeah, we did it. Okay, cool. Oh, what is this? Future is ours. Through our leader may be gone. Our lives must go on. We owe you so much. Your deeds are a living legend. We shall not forget. So you seek a forge in the heart of the mountain, hidden from our eyes. I cannot help you, but there is one who, we, who may know. Mistress Miko's maid. Okay, that's gonna do for this video then, I guess. I said they're having fun. <laughs> um... So I guess we're going to continue next time by talking to the maid, but that's going to happen next time. Uh, it was great fun, and can't wait to continue the story, so until then, I'll see you all next time. Bye!